Hello and welcome back to Chris's Corner. We have another ornament here in the Hallmark Keepsake Ornament Series. Doesn't really fall into any category of collections that we have, but I'm still going to make a video on this one. It's one we have. Um, kind of a special year for, for us. My daughter is graduating high school this year and going on to college, which is hard to believe. It's Can't already been believe it. 18 years. Yep. Can't believe she's 18 this year. She's currently out learning how to drive. Mm. <laughs> I haven't heard any sirens yet. So. Stay safe out on those roads, people. <laughs> but anyway, her grad is coming up and she'll be getting this ornament at some point in time, either around her grad or maybe we'll wait till Christmas time to get the picture of her in, in this. Well, but you, I figured I'd... You've got pictures you can put in there. Yeah, that's true. You do. Uh, did want to make a video on this anyhow. Um, so when this ornament was released this year, it was... 1999 US and 2599 Canadian. And you can still find this at the store. It's not like it's... A rare or... No, these guys aren't gonna. They'll be. Lots I don't of think these. they'll sell out. These are no. something that they they make a lot of, for this reason. I think this is one of the only ornaments we have that actually has a date on it. True. Because I don't think we've collected anything else. I mean, there's been baby's first Christmas ornaments for Star Wars, but it doesn't have a date. on it. I don't it. think. It, yeah, it didn't have a date. Oh, well, maybe it did. Maybe did the it? BB-8 maybe had a 2020. Guess we have to look at 22. We'll have to look or... at BB-8 the next time we take them out. I think it was a, wasn't there a Grogu one last Christmas? Yeah, I think so. Yeah. I don't know if it had a date on it, though. I don't know. It was we'll just baby's, baby's first Christmas. Anything on the back? Um, Just a little bit about Terry. We're going to say Steiger and Ali Smith. Terry Steiger takes her time gathering ideas and inspiration. It's her favorite part of creating keepsake ornaments. She loves diving deep into the Hallmark arch archives. A treasure trove of vintage cards, design patterns, and gift products from Hallmark's rich history. The inspiration she finds can influence a design, story, or sometimes an entire concept. No matter the source, Terry's ultimate goal is to make sure the meaning behind an ornament always shines through. Nice. That's very nice. Thanks, Terry. Hey, it's ceramic. ceramic. I thought this was going to be a plastic one. Oh, I'm intrigued. It'll be hard to get into this guy. Yes, we have not opened this one yet. Mm -hmm. You can definitely tell. It's got the little uh, promotional thing for the U.S. Um, Hallmark Club. Club. If anyone's part of this club and you've got an opinion, I'd love to know about it. I'm curious what other people think of the Keepsake Club. But for us, it wasn't going to work. Actually, if anybody's part of the club in the U.S., comment and outside of the u.s yeah comment. i want to know the, your benefits i want to know your your complaints, your complaints. yeah because we were sitting on a fence with it I, I don't know if it's a half decent thing to join but we looked at it once and it, there didn't seem to be a whole lot of benefit for us with the collections that we have but this is interesting that's the first time i've ever seen anything like that oh folded like that folded clear but okay interesting it is a nice ornament. It is. Pretty colors. Yeah. One of Caitlin's favorite colors is purple, so purple. I think she'll like that. And got a bit of a cheapy tie on it. No, that's okay. Yeah. You can always change that if you want. Ah, it would be nicer with a ribbon, but True. Man, that's my opinion. Um, and nicely you, colored. You said it was ceramic. It's it is. It's hollow. It's a hollow ceramic. So the way they pour these things, I don't know why I know, is they pour them and then there's a hole in them and then when you flip it over all the excess comes out oh weird things that i learned nothing on the back the back simple but this is how you would put your picture in and then just pops out yeah this would pop out you cut the picture to the size and then you go so we'll have to print out one of caitlin's grad pictures and pop it in there for her she does have some very gorgeous um grad pics so Nice. Make sure one of them gets in there. Yeah. And this looks like it's metal. Oh, yeah? I don't think it's plastic. I think it's actually a metal. Nice. Yeah. Yeah, very nice. Simple ornament. Yep. Right. So the challenge is going to be getting it back into the cardboard. <laughs> well, if you just fold this part down and just... It looks like it should just, you know... Yeah, That's it. Go. 
Yay. Okay, so that's pretty easy to get it back in there. Don't uh, throw out your box to the cardboard no, or anything keep, like that. No, keep, keep all this. Keep, keep your packing. Pack. Keep your packaging. So. Okay, well, simple ornament. Not a heck of a lot to tell about it. Um, I do wish all of the grads this this season a uh, happy graduation. And all the best in your future. Yeah. I do hope that you've liked this video. If you have, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel. Hit the notification bell. And above all, you have a very good day.